Okay, I'm going to show you my TRF receiver that I designed for CHU Canada. And this is the receiver here. Designed it for the 7.85 megahertz CHU signal. And this uh, design is based on my original WWV TRF receivers that I had designed for 5 and 10 megahertz. This one's very similar to the 10 megahertz version. I'll show you the differences. I had to order uh, crystals for 7.85 megahertz uh, that I got from a company in England called Quartz Lab. They're custom uh, made for uh, my application. Had to uh, change the capacitors in the filter sections for the uh, input and output filter for 7.85 megahertz. And I also did include a little bit of uh, extra capacitance uh, for the trimmer cap. I did use a capacitor at C17, a little 22 picofarad capacitor. The T1 and T2 transformers are identical to what I used in the 10 megahertz version. Same winding counts on both the uh, primary and secondaries of those transformers. It's working quite well. Come over here to the scope. It's still pretty early in the morning, but I still got a reasonably strong signal. And that's the signal right from CHU Canada, 7.85 megahertz. And I do have uh, a 50 ohm termination on the output of the TRF receiver. So that's with 50 ohm termination on the output of the TRF receiver. And it's still pretty early in the morning. The signal will increase as the day goes on here. And I'll also turn on another receiver here in the background where you can hear the audio from CHU Canada. And uh, you'll be able to see the modulation when they make the minute announcements. So it's working quite well. I'm going to go ahead now and connect the TRF receiver up to a preamp to drive my frequency counter. Okay, here's my CHU TRF receiver. Antenna's coming in to the receiver. The receiver output is connected to a preamp, a little bit over 20 dB preamp. And this is the frequency counter, so that signal's coming straight out of the preamp going to the frequency counter. I've got uh, 50 ohm termination there. And you can see... Uh, my frequency counter is uh, reading about one hertz slow. So we're reading 7.849999 megahertz. And CHU Canada, this is the 7.85 megahertz signal. And uh, looks like my frequency counter is uh, reading just about one hertz slow consistently. I'll go ahead and hook it up to my 10 megahertz receiver to show you uh, how my accuracy of my frequency counter is based on the WWV signal, so we can compare between that and a CHU signal. Okay, here's my 10 megahertz TRF receiver for WWV. Antenna coming in, preamp, preamp going to the frequency counter again with 50 ohm termination. And right now we're measuring one hertz low. Looks like a little signal fade from WWV. It's still very early in the morning. But you can see we're reading uh, 1 hertz below 10 megahertz. And that uh, agrees quite closely with what we saw with CHU Canada that was on 7.85 megahertz. So it looks like the frequency counters uh, adjusted uh, quite well. Uh, just reading a hair low in frequency, about 1 hertz.